So I made their dorm rooms and I feel like it's only fitting now to actually make them in The Sims so that they can live in their dorm rooms. So today we are going to be deck- Oh, we're not gonna be decorating dorm rooms. So today we are going to be making the Ever After High characters in The Sims 4. We are here in Create a Sim and we are going to be starting with Apple White. All the girls have the same type of like base face structure with like the small nose and the heart shaped face. But for Apple, I specifically wanted her to have these big bright eyes, these like huge eyes because that is everything that I see when I look at Apple White. She also has very soft features, so I gave her soft eyebrows, a small nose, and some small lips as well, or smaller lips. I did try to download some custom content, but I don't think it's gonna work out, so I think I'm just gonna like do Apple White casual. Does that make sense? My interpretation of Apple White. I got a picture of Apple pulled up, and she has this very like curly, just like big hair, so definitely need long, and I haven't really decided on the color. This is not the hairstyle that I'm going for but I could do this color or this color it just really depends with custom content the hair kind of looks like different or the hair color looks different on every hairstyle so we'll just choose when we find the hair that we like honestly I'm not mad at that I feel like this hair is very apple white can I change these clips though aha I can make them red okay honestly I'm pretty happy with that for the color do we want to go with this one or her hair is kind of like cold and yellowy so I think I'm gonna go for this shade for Apple's makeup, she definitely has some rosy cheeks. So let's give her a pink blush. I think I want a little bit more like peachy color. Yeah, honestly, that blush looks good. And obviously she has her signature red lip. I also think she has some eyeliner. So maybe we'll give her some of that as well. Her red lips are like very bright candy apple red. So I want to stay true to that, which I apparently have very little of said color. I think this one is our best bet. And I'm going to give her some eyeliner. I might end up changing her lashes as well. We'll see. We give her like a full, just like sleek, liner for lashes we could go bigger but i don't know if that's better necessarily her eyes are a little bit of an odd shape so the lashes are look are like conforming to that shape a little bit which i don't love i feel like this is good and maybe get like a little bit of like a glitter on her lids oh that's perfect all right moving on to the fit apple's colors are white and red and she has a little bit of like black and gold in there as well she's very girly so i want to keep with that vibe let's first start with red Ooh, something like this is very she has these like puffed up sleeves so something like that could be really cute i think i'm gonna go with that actually and maybe a white skirt all these white skirts are kind of boring i don't mind this skirt i feel like it would look best with a belt though let's see what i have have for a belt. Ooh, I feel like that is very apple white coated. For nails, it looks like apple white has white nails. So we'll give her that. Ooh, or we can give her these like white and red ones. Yeah, let's do that. I would like to give her some stockings, something like this where it's like fuzzy or fuzzy, lacy. I think that's what I'm trying to say, lacy. So stinking cute. I wish that they weren't fishnets though. That's my only thing that I don't love. Maybe I can do this and then cover them with a sock. It doesn't look right. I think the, the fishnets are okay. For shoes, Apple White has some some big red heels on so definitely gonna follow suit these ones could be good Ooh, or these or these oh my god there's so many options they're all kind of the same though i don't know why i'm tripping <laughs> I like these ones because they have the little gold detail like Apple White's shoes do. Now let's grab her some traits. Ignore these. I just had to do that to uh, save her to the gallery. For traits, I would give Apple White romantic. Oh, please ignore the poses. Ambitious. Good. And her aspiration, I think, would be maybe like Mansion Baron as like a substitute for maybe like wanting to live in a castle. And that is Apple White all complete. I think she looks so cute. I feel like the outfit is pretty accurate. Just a more casual take on Apple White. Moving on to our girl, Raven Queen. Once again, did her face off camera. I don't know why she looks a little like muddy. I don't know what's going on. Her skin color is like very, very pale. Like Raven Queen is super pale, but I did want to like capture that because she's so pale. But I also didn't want her to be like, 
literally the color white. If she looks a little muddy, I do apologize. Maybe I'll try to fix it. She look muddy. I don't know. She's just gonna be muddy, I guess. I'm so sorry. I feel like her lashes are good to go. Her hair is where it gets complicated. I did download custom content for the Ever After High girls. I don't know if it's really my style. I'll show you it and then maybe we'll think about it. So this is the hair. Personally, I don't love it. I think it's so accurate and it's like a work of art, but I just feel like it's not giving what I would like it to give. Hoping we can find a compromise of black hair with like purple streak. For Raven's hair, she has it like pulled back half up half down style. So I definitely want to give her a half up half down. Something like this could be cute, but I think I want something with it's like more off of her face. Uh, maybe she needs a little bit of a bang. Or I don't mind something like this. Do we have maybe a hair paint like color that could go into it? Oh, you know that really doesn't look that bad. Oh wait, never mind. I lied. I feel like it doesn't look too bad in the front. In the back, we're just maybe we don't look at the back. <laughs> what else do we got? Maybe I got something better. Oh. Ooh, this one's like purple streaks could be a vibe that one's not enough these streaks here are the best looking to give us like the vibe yeah i think the streaks are our best bet i'll just throw on some streaks maybe have like a better eye color maybe like a lighter one Ooh, i feel like this one better definitely want like a smoky eyeliner or something or just like a thick eyeliner would do and then like i don't know maybe a smoky liner and then because she's got some like funky eyeshadow going on it's like a she's got like a cut crease going on let's see what i have for that this one could be a contender it's like a pinky purple cut crease. Hers is a little bit more smoky. Oh, this one's also nice. Ooh, I like this like dark smoky eye. Yeah, I like this. Maybe we'll give her some bigger lashes to stick out a bit more. I like that. And for her, we'll actually give her some some earrings because we didn't give any earrings to Apple because you can't see them. And do I just want to do a regular liner? Yeah, might as well. All right, cute. And maybe a little bit of blush, just a little bit to kind of like warm her face up a bit like that. And for lips, Raven has this like deep plum color on her lips. I hopefully I can find something like that. That's perfect. For earrings, Raven is not wearing any earrings. So we're free balling with the earrings. I like these moon ones. Yeah, those are cute. Let's Let's move on to fit. Raven's outfit is very dark, lacy. She's got like this like silver neck thing going on. Actually, you know, maybe before we move on, we have like a headband she could wear. Oh, this is kind of like what she has on her head. Okay. Okay, cute. Love that. For the top, I'm thinking we go with like purple, maybe black. I don't know. I wouldn't be opposed to something with a collar since she kind of has like that silver collar. This isn't purple, but I feel like this top is very Raven. I like the collar at the top. It's giving very like spooky vibes. So I think we're going to go with this and pair it with like a purple lacy skirt, maybe. Thinking something like this, but I'm not entirely entirely sure yet. I really like this skirt. It has the lace like she has on her skirt. Moving on to accessories for nails. I think I just want to give her, she doesn't have nail polish on, so I guess it's free range. I'm thinking we go, we go with this or we could go with just like a black manicure. Yeah, let's just go with the black nails. I'm gonna give her some purple and black rings because she is wearing one in the picture that I'm looking at. And I wanna give her another chain belt just to bring in more of that silver. For stockings, I definitely want fishnets. These ones are cute. And we need some big chunky black boots, preferably with like some silver detailing on them. I think I like these boots with the big buckles on on them for traits i think we should give raven i'd say raven is loyal she is good and she is self-assured for her aspiration i don't know what to give her for aspiration maybe just like leader of the pack since she wants to start like the rebel movement at ever after high i don't know i that's the best i could uh, think of <laughs> but with her traits all done here is our raven queen i think she turned out so cute i love 
the hair piece. The hair piece is really what's selling it for me. Moving on to Madeline Hatter. I gave Madeline also some big eyes, thin eyebrows. I also, for some reason, felt like freckles would make sense for her. I don't really know. Also, I'm pretty sure her eyebrows are like red, like or brown or red. I don't know. They look kind of brown red. I'm going to do them brown, I guess. That makes a little bit more sense for them to be brown. But for Maddie, I did download a hair and probably in our best interest to use it since her hair is so particular, but we'll see how I feel about it once we have it on. So here it is. Overall, it's really not that bad. Uh, the hairline isn't great. Don't know what's going on there. Let's see if I can find something to maybe hide it. Does that make it better? I can't tell. I do want to use this hair just because it's so accurate and I don't think we're going to be able to get a hair that looks like this. Well, let me try something because really all her hair is is blue with purple money pieces. So this is pretty much the best I could come up with. I can't tell if it looks horrible. I feel like it really does look really terrible, but is it that bad? I can't tell. I feel like that's not that bad. I prefer this over the hair that I chose. It looks a little bit all over the place, but Maddie's hair is also all over the place. Is it really that far off? I feel like it's not. And you can't really tell, but I do also have some white streaks. Let's move on from the hair. I'm tired of looking at it. I do have her teacup hat. Let's see how it looks. Not loving it. Don't think I'm going to add it. Moving on to makeup. Seems pretty light. Maybe just some eyeliner, blush, and lipstick. I'm not seeing too much eyeshadow. Maybe just like some light blue and then an eyeliner. Yeah, why not? Let's give her some pinky blush. And she has like a pinky purpley lipstick on. That's a cute lip color. Moving on to her fit. Her outfit's kind of all over the place, but I'm seeing purples, beige, blue, gold, black. Like she's got every color, but maybe we'll do a purple for her top. Magenta-y purple, question mark? Yeah, something like this color, I think. I feel like this top is actually kind of similar to the one that she's wearing. And I think I'm actually gonna go with it and then maybe pair it with a blue skirt. That might be hard, but we'll see what I can do. I feel like this skirt is almost perfect. I think we're gonna go with it. I wish so badly that I had like a bow accessory for like a belt or something, but I can add this little heart detail. There's a bow in the back. She also wears gloves. So I think I'm gonna give her little gloves if I can find her something fancy enough. Oh, I do have her gloves. Do I wear, but use them? I feel like it's, I feel like we shall, honestly. And she's got some polka dot tights on, which I'm pretty sure I have the polka dot tights. Perfect. You know, it's it's a compromise. We're adding some accurate elements and then some of the elements are not accurate. I want to give her a necklace. Do I have her necklace? I don't love it. But maybe a little blue bow around her neck could be cute. Okay. And for shoes, she has on white heels with like gold accent. I feel like these shoes are perfect with like the little flowers on them. All right, moving on to traits. Madeline is definitely cheerful. I would also say she's a little erratic and, and maybe childish. We'll do friend of the world maybe. And that is it for Madeline. I think she looks super cute. I have never done an outfit like this, so it's definitely out there for me. But overall, I absolutely adore this outfit. Moving on to our last and final sim. We're going to be doing Briar Beauty. I love the name Briar. It is so stinking cute. And Briar was always my favorite because I thought that she was the one that looks close closest to me, even though we literally look nothing like but you know let me live i was like 10. i love her face i think she looks so beautiful i think she's honestly perfect i think we just need to do hair which is gonna be interesting once again i do have a hair for her let's see if i'm going to like it though i mean honestly it's the best out of all of them i will see if i can find another one i kind of like the idea of doing something like this instead i feel like it makes a little bit more sense and i do have her pink sunglasses however i have made a unfortunate discovery so i don't think we can use them maybe we'll do a little flower crown to make up for it we could also put the sunglasses on her face but i, I don't love them honestly moving on to her fit briar wears a lot of dark pinks and blacks so let's find her a pink top i think i want to go with this shirt and then maybe pair it with like a black undershirt of some sort okay something like this might not be bad can we do better maybe 
like these gloves. Maybe the shirt's just not right. Maybe this with like the light pink lace and then we just do like a dark pink skirt. Okay, I change up the outfit completely. I think this is what I wanna go with. The skirt is kind of like crossed like hers is. Her style's a little bit darker than this though. So I think I'm gonna give her like some black tights. I do have the ones that she wears in the show. So maybe I'll use those. And I did have the gloves on, but I just, I, I don't love them. Yeah, I think the black tights are enough, honestly. For nails, I'm thinking we just give her some pink nails. Those are cute. For shoes, she has on just like a pair oh. of pink heels. So let's find her a pair of those. I feel like these ones are cute. I found these cute little gloves that I think I wanna add. There's a little something something on her arms. Oh my God, I totally forgot makeup. Oh my gosh, my bad. <laughs> I got so carried away in the outfit. I just totally forgot. Eyeliner, she has this like pink cut crease going on so i think i want to add that all right i like that and for lips she just has a pink lip and a little bit of blush and a black necklace perfect just like the one that she wears in the show or traits i am gonna give her lazy because she sleeps all the time party animal and maybe a little self-absorbed but that's just because she's so gorgeous and beautiful and for her traits i think i'm gonna give her party animal for her aspiration i'm gonna give her party animal and that is our briar beauty all complete her outfit took me definitely the longest out of all the girls but I think it was worth the time spent. I personally think my favorite is Raven Queen, but comment down below which one of the girls I made today was your favorite. If you wanna download this household, you can find it under these hashtags on the gallery. But before you download it, make sure to download the custom content for it that will be linked in the description below. Without it, the Sims will not have all the clothing and the hair and the facial features that they do have. So make sure to download the custom content if you wanna download this household. And if you're still here, thank you so, so much for watching all the way to to the end of the video i appreciate you if you like this video make sure to like comment and subscribe and do all that youtube stuff all my links will be in the description below and with that all being said i will see you guys next time bye